Well, as promised in one of the previous episodes, it's time we finish off. Oh, can I just... Yep, yeah, I can fast travel here. Time to finish off the bayou. The peace of the grotto enables the shark to approach the world with greater confidence and effectiveness. I guess that's our first look at the uh, shock abilities for the shark. That's pretty cool. We can kind of like uh, teleport or clone or something. I'm here. This shark, this shark is a sort is of super, super scavenger, scavenger. Completely, completely lacking, lacking in what may be called dietary, dietary discrimination. discrimination. What? I don't discriminate. Isn't that a good thing that it is? Oh, what are you? By lusty, lusty appetites, appetites. The, the shark's, shark's sole, sole aim is to, is to eat, eat and evolve. And evolve.
Is it over here, I think? I know there's a boss in here somewhere. And I'm gonna beat it. I don't know where. It's been a long time since I beat this game. I'm using the sonar right now is so that anything I can't see will be picked up and shown on the map. So collectibles, side quests, all that stuff. I can just swim about randomly and just keep tapping the sonar to unlock all of it. There we go. I knew there was something over here I didn't yet. In spite of their reputations as wrestlers, alligators haven't mastered the nuances of scientific holds like the figure four. makes for a fascinating, if not slightly nauseating, spectacle. Huh. So I'm missing one thingamajigger, which I can grab. And a uh, chest. the chest. Did I already kill the boss in this area? Huh. Supercharged with gene-altering mutagens, the shark now has an asymmetric edge on the competition. Yes, I did. Wait. Yeah, it looks like... That's it. It's the only thing I'm missing. Trying to kill me. State of Dead Horse Lake is alarming. We can be assured that a new era of environmental stewardship will restore order to our treasured wild places. <laughs>
Well, there's an alligator, but it's not exactly the one I was looking for. No one can tell what may be found in a shark's stomach. It's true, the ocean's garbage can. Did you go over there? Okay, I'm pretty sure it's safe to say that the alligator is dead. And my barracuda is delicious. Go another like the threats to our ocean seem overwhelming, but by, but by working, working together, together now, we can we ensure can that future, future generations, generations always have a place, have a place to, dump to dump their old tatas. Certainly heating, heating up, up the evolutionary, the evolutionary arms, arms race. race. Okay, maybe I can find this one. here, bud.
I would like to assure the Antolini crime family that this footage will in no way be used in the final edit of our program. <laughs> The appetite of this shot is really insatiable. Especially large groupers have been known to swallow sharks whole. So the bad feelings here go both ways. to be a voracious and heartless criminal. I know this was a pretty short one, but I think I'll end the video here. We got back to the bayou. We uh, had a bit of fun. Actually, no. I'll eat these guys first. Even on a crowded beach, it's foolish for humans to assume we are immune from zoological dangers. Man, man. I wouldn't know him for man. If he kill another fisherman, that's between them and him. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to leave the video here for now.